everybody, Brian from Colorado Cultures here. So, we wanted to show you a little video on what trichodermia is. So, trichodermia is a type of fungus that is found in all soils. So, in mycology, a good way to avoid it is that we clean our grains really well or we sterilize them properly. This is a bag that we intentionally did not clean and we sterilize improper just to show you what trichodermia kind of looks like. As you can see, it grows more on the outside and central locations outward. And it's real fuzzy looking too. It has like a turquoisey, sometimes gray looking color to it. But they, you know, they start in very big spots and come out and they will double in size within 24 hours. So that's a good way to tell if it's trike or isolate or oxidized mycelium. Over here is what oxidized mycelium looks like. As you can see, it's a little blue, but it's not in big colonies and it's more spread out throughout the bag. That comes from, I guess, manhandling your bag a little bit too much, you know, looking at it to see if it's colonized or not. This would be from improper sterilizing or not washing your grains properly before you actually sterilize them. When you sterilize them, you can use a pressure cooker or auto plate. So, but a few things to kind of keep in mind when you're making a good grain to avoid trichodermia and to sterilize correctly is for something that is smooth and something that is a small size that can get sterilized in a relatively quick time. So, talking more like corn, milo, millet, maybe rye berries, things like that. A couple grains to avoid are definitely whole oats. They have a lot of crevices that endospores of trichodermia can hide out and actually survive sterilization techniques. That's where rinsing your grains will really come in handy. So, just a couple of other things to avoid going to be sunflower seeds. You always want to get rid of those things. They have a lot of ridges as well. And just something to do when you do get trichodermia is... See you, trike!